When we found this 100,000 square foot facility, you know, I looked at Mark LaMancha, my father and CEO, and said, this is crazy. There's no way we're gonna be able to fill this whole building with only two machines. Lo and behold, four years later, here we are with seven S-Max machines in this building. How does a small manufacturer in Columbiana County, Ohio, go from producing conventional tooling for the foundry industry to become one of the largest sand 3D printing operations in the world? With Fortitude, Faith, and X1 Technology, the father-son duo of Mark and Brandon LaMancha have almost single-handedly commercialized the North American sand 3D printing industry. My father, Russell, started Humtown Pattern Company with a partner in a small garage on our site where we're currently at today. My interests lied more with technology and innovation and machinery. So we started a, a sand core manufacturer outside of the foundry in 1977. An opportunity arose to be an early adopter of sand binder jetting technology in 2014 through a project with America Makes and Youngstown State University. The investment in X1 Sand 3D printing was the beginning of a massive transformation for the company. By having this technology, it advances us to probably one of the most uh, advanced core manufacturers in the United States, if not the world. So this technology has enabled us to work with clients that we never would have worked with in the past, and it puts us in the forefront of, you know, of technology providers in our foundry industry. It gave us an ability to do sand cores differently than we were ever able to do them before. With the X1 machine, you have full and equal density. So it, it basically produces a, a, a near-perfect core. Our clients have a unique need. When they need something, they need it very quickly. And these machines are very robust. You know, they perform you know, when we need them, where we need them, up to very high volume. You know, the job box on these, you know, these pieces of equipment are some of the largest in the industry. And when we can have that type of throughput, and our customer has uh, you know, an urgent build and we can perform it here. So the speed to market, you, know, is, is, you can't even put a price on that for a lot of our clients. The speed with which Humtown was able to adopt the technology and deliver fast turnarounds to their customers has required them to continually add new machines to keep up with the ever-increasing demand. However, the company hasn't abandoned the conventional operations and in fact are in a unique position to have 3D printing technology complement their core services. You know, if we have a customer that has a unique need that we can't fulfill in our conventional facility, you know, it's, an, it's an automatic fit here in 3D printing. By being the only sand core manufacturer in North America that has both, we're able to really balance that. Over the years, Humtown and X1 have partnered to maximize the potential of the technology to make it even more efficient and economical for their customers. X1 has been a great partner. Um, you know, we have service technicians that come in you know, almost any time of the day or night. You know, we really have developed you know, and forged a strong relationship. The beauty is we're in the infancy of binder jetting and you know, the opportunities to print silica sand and ceramic and other media. And I think we're just scratching the surface of what we'll be able to utilize this technology for. The Humtown story is far from over. As leaders in the commercialization of sand 3D printing and with their commitment to their employees and the community, the company has received numerous recognitions and awards, including being named the 2020 Small to Medium Manufacturer of the Year by the National Association of Manufacturers. For over seven years now, I've been going out into the industry and really you know, talking about the opportunities that 3D printing brings to the foundry industry. And it's really been nice to start seeing a full-on embrace of that you know, and the adoption of that to where now companies are actually coming to us and looking at us for expertise you know, on how and when and where to use additive manufacturing in the foundry. And then also, when does it make sense for them to you know, not only use Humtown as a service provider, but to put one of these machines in their facility. I see the future for the Humtown products team that I serve in always working on tomorrow today, in always looking at two new technologies, in always embracing those technologies and stepping up to the innovators of those technologies. It's an amazing moment and opportunity in time.